right. Hello everyone, this is Goran from BPMS. I'm here with Julio at Tier 57. And we're at an event that he's hosting today. So Julio, why don't you tell us about this event? Yeah, so uh, this is a get together for uh, plastic model builders, uh, scale modelers, anybody who loves the hobby of scale modeling. Uh, we're all just here hanging out, building models together, having a good time. And uh, you know, we got a, a lot of different models here. We got tanks, we got some uh, cars, we got some Gunpla, mainly Gunpla. But uh, everybody that loves building plastic models, they're here. Yeah. And this isn't the first event that you host it, right? Uh, no, this isn't. I, uh, Pre-COVID, I used to do these at uh, Kinokuni in New York, over by Times Square. Uh, it was geared more towards uh, Gunpla builders than anything, but uh, we held an event there, they liked it, we decided to do it, keep doing it every month. Um, once lockdown started happening, we couldn't really do them anymore, you know, safety concerns for the public, safety concerns for the people that work at the store. And uh, it's been a good few years since we've done that. Yeah, it's understandable. I mean, you know, between uh, COVID, you know, you, you don't want anybody out here. But anyway, I mean, the, the location here that you picked, I mean, this is great. I mean, we're at Pier 57. There's eatery outside. Right, right. Nice scenic view. It, this is just a great place to hang out. Now, what, what motivate you? You know, to, to organize all this. Uh, this is this this stems from a love of scale modeling, and uh, this hobby in general is something that I want to share with other people. And uh, you know, I just want to bring that joy that I feel of building plastic models to others that enjoy plastic models themselves. You know, we, we all spend a lot of time at home working on our models. You know. Why can't we do that together as a group? Yeah. I know. It, it, it feels kind of like, you know, it's a little lonely when you're building models. You can't really share that love and joy of doing something. Right, right. right. It's, it's, it's a little different when uh, you love something and you're enjoying it on your own versus, you know, you love something and you're enjoying it with other people who love it just as much as you do. I know. It's just like, you know, while I'm doing this, I, I kind of want to share, you know, the work I do. Like, yeah, like that's yeah, awesome. yeah. And yeah. that's and that's... That's that's the cornerstone of every scale model. Everybody yeah. wants to work on something, and you know you want to share that with other people. And I have to say, the, the turnout's great. You got you know your uh, the uh, the gun club group that you're usually with, and uh, BPMS. We have our members here. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm very thankful for the turnout. A lot of people are here. We got a lot of model builders. You know, even the people who are just kind of hanging out, supporting us. You know, it's it's a great turnout. It's enjoyable. Yeah, and the thing is, it's not even something that's very complicated i mean we don't even really have to like bring out like these complicated model kits especially the kits nowadays with uh with the bandai kits i notice a lot of everyone here almost is building uh something from you know bandai gunpla right right yeah uh, a lot of a lot of different grades for the models and uh you know different complexities and we, we have a lot of beginner friendly kits we have a lot of advanced kits you know for the more experienced scale modeler and uh like, it doesn't matter what level you are. You're, yeah. here, you're here, you're building, you're enjoying something. And, and some of these kits, I mean, they're color plastic bits, like you said. Uh, yeah, yeah, very easily accessible. Uh, plastic is already, you know, colored. It's white, blue, red, yellow, doesn't matter what it is. It's, it's, uh, it makes it very accessible for everybody. But I have to say, with an event like this, this is great, especially with the expansion of uh, a lot of these gun plot kits. I mean, years ago, uh, it was popular, like, Somewhat in the 19, late 1990s, but then it kind of fizzled out. But now they just kind of like came back and just completely blew in the last, you know, the past uh, 10, 15 years. Yeah, yeah, it's definitely become more popular. Uh, I think it's definitely due to the success of how more accessible the models are. Oh, yeah, and the addition, like you said, like entry grade. Yeah, yeah, they have entry grades, they have high grades, there's real grade, there's master grade, there's perfect grade, there's 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 jumbo grade, which is very hard to come across, by the way. But, um, you know, the models, you can build them together and uh, you don't even have to paint them which is kind of like a big thing for a lot of people that do want to enjoy models but just can't you know don't have the setup at home to work on them the way they want to yeah especially for something like this I mean it's great you just come out here most of these kits are snap-ons you don't have to worry about you know having to bring like too much stuff like oh I gotta do this I gotta paint maybe you just bring it out just build it maybe if you want to paint it you can always bring it home and yeah, 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 it yeah you just you take it out the box start working on it and you put as much commitment 
excitement as you want into it as anything else. And I think this is great for an event that you you know for parents you know uh, especially those who also build. I mean, you could bring your kid out, give them an entry grade. You know, you can buy them an entry grade and just, yeah, yeah, you know, totally. It's like look, it, no matter what your age is, well. Well, the model kits actually do give you kind of an age limit, but, you know... <laughs> who's stopping you, but, us? We, like, right, we really right, read that, right? right? right. But, uh, but, you know, you would give a simple model to somebody who's just starting out, you know, get their feet wet, get them involved, to learn, you know, just the basics, what they have to do, and then, you know... Especially in nowadays with all these video games and, you know, online social media stuff, I mean, sometimes you do... I mean, if I had a kid, I would pride them away and try to get them on hands or something, you know, that, that that's more on hands and, you know, just hang online. Well, I'm a... I, me, myself, I'm a firm believer of hands-on experience mm -hmm. and learning things, and I think models in general are very good medium for that. Yeah, I you think... Know, this is something that you can physically work with with your hands. This is something that you physically, as you're, as you're working, you're learning. Yeah, I, I feel the same where you, have, you learn patience and you learn, you know, skill. Yeah, yeah, no, it definitely teaches you a bit of discipline. Build character, right? There. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, totally. Okay. And I think, I think what you're doing is wonderful, promoting this hobby, getting people together, uh, you know, just, just hang out, trading ideas, discussing, just, just the love of doing something, you know, instead of being cooped up at home alone. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, I mean, look, something like this is happening, you could stay at home and build a model, or you could uh, come out and hang out with other people who build models. Yeah. Now, are you planning more events like this in the future? Uh, yes, yes. G given the turnout of this event, it's, I think it was very good. Mm -hmm. um, I think it's excellent. We're definitely going to be doing more. Um, I think I, I think we're probably aiming for bi-monthly. Mm -hmm. As opposed to monthly, I don't want I don't want anybody who comes to these to feel like they have to be here. Mm. They have to go to it. Like I, the last thing I want is somebody to feel like they have to be somewhere. I know you want to make people have to be comfortable and kind of enjoy coming. Right, right, and that's and that's that's the major point of it. You're coming here. It's accommodating. It's bright. It's well lit. It's welcoming. Everybody here is very friendly. Yeah. And Even if you don't know people, hey, it's a great come, place come, to meet people. Come, come make a new friend. Nobody here bites. <laughs> and, and if, you know, Julio here would definitely introduce you to other people. Yeah, you know, yeah. he, he knows almost everybody here. Plenty, plenty of people to learn from, plenty of people to meet. Everybody's all different skill levels. You know, we have people who just started in the hobby and we have people who've been doing it for years. So it's, there's, there's, there's somebody to talk to, there's always a new friend to be made. And look, if you're the person who doesn't want any new friends and you just want to hang out with other people, everybody's fine with that too. Well, Julio, thank you so much for number one, organizing the event. Number no two, you know, no uh, you know, having this little interview, yeah. you know, discuss. Yeah, fan, fan. thanks for, uh, you know, taking the time to speak with me. <laughs> You're welcome. Really appreciate it. All right. So, yeah. So, Julio's planning to do more. Um, you can always stay tuned to, uh, you know, BPMS. We usually post out any events, especially uh, Julio himself is also a member of BPMS. Yes, yes. So, when there's any news, we'll be posting it out. So, everyone, have a great day. Thanks for watching. Take care.